Air Force Two confirmed. Landing strip the President and Vice President are confirmed. Please confirm copter reception. Copters confirmed. Proceed to Entrance Alpha. Entrance Alpha, standby. presidential party is now inside the complex. Mr. President, you were able to see Mrs. Nixon to safety, I take it? Ah, uh, yes, yes. Uh, Pat, she, uh, that is, Mrs. Nixon, she's okay now. How are things hanging here? Well, as you know, I see no profit in employing mad bomber tactics. Don't, don't you start that mad bomber shit. That whole image, it was your suggestion. Now, what's the latest? East Germany tanks massing allegedly in response to Western alarmism. Ah, uh, that might possibly be genuine. This last week we've both been on full alert. The question is, what do we do next? We do what we came down here for. We stay at DEFCON 2. And we sit. And we wait. How much longer? Tired of skulking down here. Impatient. Work to be done. Rorschach, everybody's looking for us. We'd better be careful. Down here, hours already. Need to collect spare uniform and personal effects so that we can proceed. All right, all right. That's what I'm doing. We're near the wharves backing onto your neighborhood right now. I'm taking her up. At last. Feels good to be working with you again, Daniel. Pity Miss Yuspechik couldn't stay with us. Yes. Yes. It's a pity. So, assuming your spare outfit's where you left it, where do we start? Make inquiries amongst Underworld. Whatever's behind elimination of masked heroes is something big. Makes ripples. Out there, somewhere. Somebody knows. Yeah, I guess so. Also, with this masked killer thing, we should contact Adrian. Yes. Perhaps you'll be less dismissive of idea after attempt on own life. The thing is, we've got so little time to figure out who's doing this. I mean, neutralizing John, framing you, we're talking somebody major. Yes, all accomplished so easily. Lesson in vulnerability. Must be more careful in future. The future? What future? That's my whole point. We're looking at World War III within the week. I mean, what do we do? The stakes are so high, and humanity is so close to the edge. Some of us have always lived on edge, Daniel. It is possible to survive there if you observe rules. Just hang on by fingernails, and never look down. Uh, still here. Good. Police didn't find it. <clears throat> exactly what uh, personal effects were you looking for? Spare clothes, spare face, final draft of journal. Police only found rough notes. There. Think that's everything. We... Oh, God! I... I don't want any trouble, okay? I... Mrs. Sharp, long time no see. Told press I'd made sexual advances to you. Not true. Very bad. No, I, I never said that. I got misquoted. Rorschach, come on, man. Leave it. Can't. Serious business. Slur on reputation. How much did they pay you to lie about me, whore? Oh, please, don't say that. Not in front of my kids. Please. They... They, they don't know. Got what we came for. Finished here now. Let's go.
Welcome back, sir. It is good to have you safe with us. We received bulletins from New York. The attempted shooting. Ah, oh, yes. Yes, these are dangerous times. Hello, Bovastis. Hello, old girl. Do you still wish to study the monitors and record your observations before dinner? No, let dinner wait. The work comes first, as ever. There are things to do, problems to solve. Incidentally, did the delivery run smoothly in my absence? Oh, yes. We three supervised the reception unaided as instructed. The monitors have been prepared, sir. How many screens did you wish to view? All of them. Random channel change every hundred seconds. I need information. Information in its most concentrated form. Hmm, let me see. First impressions. Oiled muscle man with machine gun. Cut to pastel bears, valentine hearts. Juxtaposition of wish fulfillment, violence, and infantile imagery. Desire to regress, be free of responsibility. This all says, war. We should buy accordingly. I think I'm ready to begin recording now. Very good. We shall retire and leave you to your work. We know that you prefer to be alone down here. Yes, that's right. All alone. Just me and the world. Hate this. All day on riverbed. Drowned corpses more useful. You said we could proceed. These computer searches, I've been running our procedure. When it's dark again, we'll go up. This is no picnic for me, either. Implying something about coat, perhaps. Old, slightly musty. Apologies. I wasn't... Look, I just meant we took enough unnecessary risks retrieving your outfit this morning. Cowering down here in sludge and pollution, conjuring names on screens, learning nothing. That is unnecessary. Give me smallest finger on man's hand. I'll produce information. This face, all that's necessary. All I need. That's bullshit. You needed darkness to work with, just like I do. Right now, I need some pattern that makes sense of the data we have. The comedian mentioned an island and some plot against John. My computers suggest John could have been set up, possibly by the company all his supposed victims worked for. Possibly. We should ask questions in the underworld. Isn't that what I'm doing? You waste time looking for pattern when pattern is obvious. The mask killer. If you listen, that's what I'm trying to say. What if there is no mask killer? Look, the comedian learned accidentally about some island, some scheme against John. The plot against John comes first. Blake's killed when he discovers it. Who knew Blake suspected anything? This dimensional developments company employed Moloch. Maybe his place was bugged when Blake visited? That'd also explain how they knew about your investigations and were able to frame you without requiring any mask killer. Invite? Hmm. Adrian's a problem. That was a clear-cut assassination attempt. Exactly. So trace killer, visit bars, squeeze people. Been lazing around a long time. Maybe you've forgotten how we do things. Lazy? Listen, I've had it. Who the hell do you think you are? You live off people while insulting them. Nobody complains because they think you're a goddamn lunatic. You know how hard it is being your friend? Daniel, you are a good friend. I know that. I am sorry that it is sometimes difficult. Ah, uh, hey. Hey, forget it. It's okay, man. It's okay. Ah, uh, well, anyway, there's... <clears throat> there's no sense waiting down here any longer. I mean, down here in this junk garden, is this any place to hold the reunion of the Night Owl Rorschach team? Let's go up to visit the criminal fraternity and really start plumbing the depths. You know, some nice straightforward brutality? Hell, it'll be like coming home. I was returned. Splashing noisily through the encumbering shallows, sun mulling the horizon behind me. I could be no more than 20 miles from David's town. I was home. In broad, charcoal strokes, night shaded the sky. 
By now, David's town was overrun, my family slaughtered. Only revenge remained. Deliberating upon this, I startled at the sound of horses approaching. Voices, male and female. I recognized the man, a money lender from David's town. Why would brigands allow this scoundrel free passage for his midnight trysts? Had he collaborated? My raft was discovered. He comforted the weeping hysterical woman, and my heart grew cold. Was my wife comforted before her execution? Now they would report my raft. Overripe, the money lender's head burst with a single blow, exploding as if pressurized by the guilt within. The woman I strangled. This took considerably longer than I had anticipated. Look! Everybody's scared they'll drop it tonight! At death's approach, all creatures discover an aptitude for violence. The horses watched, understanding only a little. People know something's coming. Ask me? It's doomsday. Thumbs crossed, I closed her windpipe. In the foam about my ankles, two worlds lay ended. Good day, sir. I'd like to purchase a cassette, if I may. Eh? Huh? Sure. That's what I'm here for. Seeking vengeance, might I turn this unforeseen circumstance to my advantage? An idea blossomed. Plausible. Tempting. There, now. We've bought one of your papers. Perhaps you'd like to try ours. Huh? We believe God will shortly end the world. How does that idea strike you? The notion fascinated me. It was terrible, and yet terribly convenient. End the world? No way, Jose! Oh, I see. Well, we're just leaving. Tied to her saddle, she looked quite natural. Goddamn fanatics! Itching to say, I told you so, wouldn't give them the satisfaction. Two figures had ridden here. Now, two rode back. Soon. Soon, I would venture amongst evil men and make them fear me. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, yes. Missed you while in prison, boys. Feels good to be back. Need information. Adrian Veidt shot at. Press gave killer's name as Roy Victor Chess. Dead now. Somebody knew Roy Chess. Somebody hired him. Won't insult legendary underworld solidarity by suggesting you surrender name without torture. You keep away from me. You come any closer, you're gonna get this in your goddamn squidgy face. Stupid. All right, everybody stay calm. We'll try to keep this brief. Roy, Chess, how's your game? Listen, please. I just handed over these envelopes to, to the guy. I don't know anything about it. What envelopes? Sealed envelopes. One with cash, one with instructions. I had to find a reliable contract hit. Give him both. Nobody mentioned Vite. Got offered the errand by my boss, freight coordinator at Pyramid Deliveries. Ah, poison capsules in envelopes. M maybe. Hell, I don't know. I took the job. A lot of other guys were getting some action. I figure, why not? Now, everybody's getting killed. Killed? All the other freight handlers who were in on things. Supposed to be accidents. My boss. Guy gave me the envelopes. He fell under a subway train. I'm next. I need protection. <laughs> I swear. Something bothering you, son. Get off my case. Wearing a knot doesn't mean I'm connected with that stuff last night. I heard the news, blaming that Mason guy's murder on knot tops. I thought, shit, like they needed excuses to hassle us. So you gotta protect me. <laughs> Who did it? Who murdered Hollis? Don't know, kids saw a gang running away. Tell them they're dead. I ought to take off this entire rat whole neighborhood. Oh, goddamn. Goddamn, goddamn, goddamn. Not in front of civilians. We have the knowledge that we wanted. Yeah. Yeah, and then some. Let's get out of here. Hollis. Oh, Christ, man. 
Why? We, we... Take this and bring Archie down. Unidentified gang murders Mason. Supports mass killer theory. Look, I don't care. Merely suggesting that by finding mass killer can have revenge for Mason's death. Meant to comfort you. Comfort me? Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. Thanks, Rorschach. Oh, really? You're welcome. Now know who paid to kill Vite. Information should convince him to help us. Mr. Shea, it's very dark down here. What if someone should discover us? Relax, everybody's up on deck for the evacuation party. Once the last of the equipment's aboard, the ship's ready to put out. How about you? What? Mr. Shea? Really? <laughs> Hira, come on, we're celebrating. Tonight we leave this place after all these months. Hell, I saw Norm Leaf and Lynn Paley up on deck. Even they were smiling. Well, they're being paid enough to vanish and forget their cares. You know, this movie has involved extraordinary secrecy. Yeah, and I know why. That geneticist guy, Furness, told me they'd used a human brain making that goddamn special effect. Hey, feel that? We're moving. That isn't all I can feel. Mm, Hero, meeting you makes up for everything. Hell, what's digging into my arm? Forget it, whatever it is. I can't wait until a hotel. Max, for God's sake. Max? You're so pale. What's wrong? Nothing, love. Nothing's wrong. Hold me. Vanished without trace. Funny, usually works here until early in morning. The whole building looked deserted as we came in. Maybe he... Wait a minute. What's this? Appointment book? November 1st, 4.30 a.m. Leave for Karnak. Karnak? Question is, what next? No delivery company behind Vite murder bid. Also owners of dimensional developments. Thus, maybe behind Manhattan frame. What's their angle? I'd hope Adrian might help with that. Um, not sales chart. What is it? Well, with a curve like that, it's either his IQ or his income. Global population, nuclear hazard escalation index, environmental decline, multiple crisis graph, lines converging mid-1990s, optimistic. Crisis arrives decade early unless we get lead on pyramid deliveries. Company traceable, presumably, but obviously not amateurs. Need direct route to people behind pyramid, indication where to start. Also need motive. Why should corporation wish to kill costume heroes? Who has reason for triggering Armageddon? Insanity would seem only motive. Someone wishes to destroy world, removes heroes to prevent their intervention. Need to unearth facts concerning murders. Blake's and Jacoby's. Must admit, despite personal dislike, Byte's absence, unfortunate. Could no doubt have provided some answers. Need answers quickly. World on verge of apocalypse. Death and war already here. Other horsemen can't be far behind. Funny. Ancient pharaohs looked forward to end of world. Must be holding breath with anticipation. Oh, shit. Daniel, found something. Rorschach, I think we're in bad trouble. The person behind this, the person we're up against, I think it's Adrian. All this Egyptian stuff. I thought I'd check out pyramid deliveries on his computer. As password, I tried Ramesses too, the Egyptian name for Ozymandias. He runs it, Rorschach. Runs pyramid deliveries, dimensional developments, the whole show. But Veidt was target. I know it's crazy, and I don't want to believe it, but perhaps we should find Adrian fast. Karnak. Ramesses built a gigantic hall there, a monument. Karnak must be Veidt's Antarctic retreat. 
Better grab those papers from his desk. It's a long journey, and they'll make better reading than the life jacket instructions. Rorschach's journal, November 1st, 1985. Final entry. Left Veidt's office just before midnight. Dryberg convinced Veidt's behind everything. He's serious about visiting Antarctica. Our ship capable, apparently. But are we? Veidt cannot imagine more dangerous opponent. He could kill us both there in snow. Nobody would ever know. Veidt is faster than Dryberg, perhaps faster than me. Return from mission seems unlikely. This last entry will shortly mail journal to only people can trust. Tell Dryberg I need to check my mail drop. He believes me. If reading this now, whether I am alive or dead, you will know truth, whatever precise nature of this conspiracy. Adrian Veidt responsible. Appreciate your recent support and hope world survives long enough for this to reach you. But writing is on wall. For my own part, regret nothing. Have lived life free from compromise. And step into the shadow now, without complaint. Rorschach, November 1st, 1985. It ain't fair. We didn't ask for no war. There's no goddamn justice in this world. Unrecognizable in corpses' clothing, I was the concealed implement of God's retribution. The ordinary guy got no protection. Abandoning the naked moneylender to the cold surf, I led the horses from the beach. Ahead, Davidstown lay sleeping, little dreaming what approached. I mean, at least those super guys tried to protect folk. I spied the dark, unmoving form of a pirate sentry. Boy, this war business, eh? Uh, just a gazette, please. No offense, man. But I'm in kind of a rush. I rode past. Hi, Joey. How's things? Don't know. Aline's meeting me from work tonight to discuss things. Now she's pissed, because that clashes with Pale Horse's Madison Square gig. I spurred the horses on towards that inevitable confrontation. Hey, lighten up. It ain't the end of the world. Dear God, let me have vengeance. Then die swiftly. Delivered at last into the hands of a higher judgment. Mail for you. Uh, thanks. Seymour, bring that in here and open it. I mean, Red Holocaust about to break. Am I supposed to handle things by myself? Uh, this first one, some journal. Dead dog in alley this morning. Tire tread on burst stomach. Jesus, who's it from? Son of Sam? Sling it on the crank file. New Year will burn that garbage heap and start over. War's coming and this paper has a mission. God damn it. The Reds could have emptied their silos five minutes ago. The birds could be in the air right now. How much further? Said we were over Antarctica hours ago. Wright's fortress is nearby, along the coastline. You feel that kicking in the engine? Like it's about to seize? Ice. Shit. I bet it's ice. Coming in too low towards cliffs. You okay? Twisted ankle, nothing serious. How bad is damage to ship? Difficult to say. Probably nothing I couldn't fix given a few hours. It'd be quicker to cover the remaining distance on the hover bikes. You break out the bikes while I get into my snowsuit. Uh, you sure? I can't fit you out in something a little warmer? Fine, like this. Everything's all right.